I've come up to the church on Ascension morning. I've been here as the dawn breaks and got a fire going. You hear the bird song. Been spending some time in prayer. And I wanted to share a particular prayer with you. This is the view from 30,000 feet, based on the end of Mark's Gospel and the end of Luke's Gospel. The moment when Jesus ascends into the clouds. leaving the disciples to be his hands and feet on earth, sending them back to Jerusalem to wait, to be open to the Spirit, and then to tell the good news, our simple instruction, wait be open, share the good news. So here we go, the view from 30,000 feet. This path of ascension, prefigured in Christ, lifts us up and opens us out into vistas of self, nature and culture, not visible through eyes of fear, but teaches leave-taking love, his parting gesture of calling in a substitute spirit to fill us with power and fuel our own liftoff carries us into a holy orbit and with Christ we enjoy the view from 30,000 feet. An awesome horizon rises up, a new self, a new community, a new earth, a new perspective and a blessed confidence to walk forward and realize the ever receding horizon of the kingdom of God. The ever receding horizon of the kingdom of God. This morning I've come here to pray for that kingdom in times when we are asked to step back from action. We can pray and sing with the birds. To bring that kingdom into the world through our love so this Ascension morning, may you be filled with the spirit of love and hope for the world. May your hearts be set on fire with love to do the work of God in whatever place is your habitation. Amen.